Yo, what is up everybody and welcome back to another NBA 2K16 My Career Game. 67 games into the season, these two teams have identical records. Those identical records give them a tie for first in the Eastern Conference. This game can help decide who has home court throughout the playoffs in the Eastern Conference as Derrick Rose takes off and Rose just gonna scoop it up and in right there to give the Bulls the early lead but here comes Tice on the break looking for Gerald Green but Green misses the dunk of all things the super athletic Gerald Green missing usually what he does best as we find Justice Winslow in the corner that's a deep two that's a shot made but we are down early on because the Bulls are just executing better don't that time that was far from good execution that's gonna leave Danny Tice wide open on the break the matchup at point guard for the most part will be Tice versus Rose we'll see which one of the superstar point guard shows up and one guy you may notice is not on the court as Tice drains a three is Dwayne Wade Wade has a broken hand out for a month this is a huge injury for us, so even if we win this game as we block um, Brooks there, get a nice chase down block, then starts a fast break opportunity right here. Slowing it down and eventually find Drogic and Drogic drains the jump shot right there to give us the assist. So yeah, Wade is injured. Even if we win this game, our chances of getting to the number one seed is in jeopardy as Tice almost gets the and one right there. The Bulls still leading, but we're hanging in there early on in this game. You know what's... We're just keeping it back and forth, back and forth. It looks like it's going to be a close game throughout. So as long as no one goes in that big run, you know, we're fine with that. As Denny Tice with the floater getting it in there. Denny Tice adding the floater to his arsenal and using it right there over Derrick Rose. As you guys see, Justice Winslow finding Tice wide open. Perfect release. Tice sticks the jumper. And Miami's got the lead near the end of the second quarter. That's a Chicago Bulls miss. We have been running in the first quarter and we continue to just try to pace these Bulls. I feel like we have the more athletic team. The Bulls have people like Noah and Gasol who are wearing down a little bit, even Derrick Rose. So if we could run on them a little bit, that would be great. And that's what we're doing right now in transition. Looking for Whiteside and Hassan Whiteside using the dribble. You don't see Whiteside use the dribble. As you guys see the standings right here, what I was talking about. Tie for first. The Cavs are very far behind in third place. So it's basically a two-man race for the number one seed as Denny Tice for three. Bang! Denny Tice is hot from downtown three for four shooting 21 points overall but that too is going to chris bosh and like i said it's all about who goes in that big run and it looks like it's going to be the miami heat on that run denny tice for three again bang denny tice that was from way downtown but he still got to go he's on fire they better make sure to guard him and now we're slithering into the paint Denny Tice doing a little bit of everything right now. This is Drogic with the ball. Looking for the superstar point guard. But he slows it down instead. But here comes Tice taking the three. But not making the three. It rattles in and out. Over Miritich. Could not get it to go. Here Miritich looking for the three of his own. Bang! Nikola Miritich gives the Bulls the lead right back on a big time shot. This is Evan Turner spotting up and knocking down Evan. Actually, it's Aaron Brooks with the three point shot right there. As Denny and he ties all the way to the rim. Miritich could do nothing about the 5'11 beast as that three is missed. The Bulls got high, but that's Miritich getting the board, drawing the foul, and almost getting the in. One of the Bulls all of a sudden have a five-point lead as Tice almost gets the steal. Instead, Rose draws the foul and gets the in. One finish himself over Lou all dang, and the Bulls are starting to put together that run. It's all about who gets those string of plays going to pull away in this one. As Denny Tice misses a three, started off hot but cooling off quickly. But so is Miritich, who was hitting a few big threes in that third quarter. Here's Gerald Green, the new starter in place of Dwayne Wade, but he could not get that jump shot to go. As Tice is called for a little ticky tacky foul right there. Still a six point game. Offenses have cooled down a bit, but here comes Jimmy Bower just blowing by Gerald Green right there. As that's a man dropping to the ground. That leaves Tice wide open, and Denny Tice, the jump shot is just working for him tonight is it working for jimmy butler yes it is bang jimmy butler makes it an eight point bulls lead hard to overcome especially without our fourth quarter closer as luol dang takes it all the way wade has been mr fourth quarter for us mr clutch he will always score in these situations 
But without him, who do we rely on? It's going to have to be a little bit more Denny Tice, a little bit more Chris Bosh, maybe a little bit more Gerald Green. And Gerald Green trying to provide any fireworks he can. A big three makes it a two-point game. Gasol in the post, fading and hitting Pau Gasol. And under three minutes to go, makes it back a two-possession lead. Denny Tice, pump faking, trying to draw a foul. And that's what we do. And Noah almost getting the end one, but we do go to the free throw line. We nail both free throws. Rose with the ball. Rose loses the ball, gets it back, driving and making it. Almost a disastrous play for Rose, but he makes a positive out of that one. Back to a four-point game. Gerald Green with the sick finish right there in the paint. It's back and forth. Who's going to get the defense? Or stops. It's going to be the Miami Heat on that possession. Turnover on Pau Gasol. Once again, defense, Miami Heat. Jimmy Bower, no foul call. A chance to tie or take the lead on this possession. Denny Ty's pushing. Denny Ty's looking. Finding Green for three in the lead. Gerald Green is off. Miritich or Gasol actually grabs the board. And now Rose is looking to push in transition. Denny Tice with the foul. Not on the penalty yet. So that foul has no impact on the game. As Denny Tice driving, floating, and Denny Tice ties the game up with 47 seconds left. Miami needs to play some defense here. Derrick Rose looking to carry the team. Jimmy Bower looking to give him the lead. But Bower misses the wide open three after Green fell down. No timeout. Miami Heat pushing tights with the ball to Whiteside. And Whiteside for the lead. Gets the layup to go. 99-97 with under 30 seconds to go. The Bulls need to get this bucket right now. They are out of timeouts. You know they're looking for Rose or Bower. Rose firing for the ball. Rose has got it. He's jab stepping. He's firing in the paint for Turner. And Evan Turner ties it right back up with 25 seconds left. Shot clock is not turned off. But the Heat will try to drain as much clock as possible. Bulls are out of timeouts. We are aware of that. So we're going to try to take this shot as late as possible. If anything, worst case scenario, this goes to overtime or we win the game. Clock continues to wind. Seven seconds left. White side coming to set the pick. Tice still with the ball. Tice driving. Tice for the lead. Danny Tice running away. No timeouts for the Bulls. They're going to have to chuck up a Hail Mary for the win. Rose is off. Miami escapes the United Center with the victory. A comeback in the fourth. Capped off by a game-winning Euro step by Danny Tice. You won't see many game-winning Euro steps, but that one was absolutely beautiful. Skating away from Gasol and finishing it over Jimmy Bowen, who was trying to play that help defense. A new career high for Denny Tice, 39 points, and none more important than that last bucket. Leave a like on this video if you enjoyed the game. Subscribe for more NBA 2K16 My Career Games, and I will catch you guys next time.